The purpose of this video is to demonstrate how to clean the spur blocks during monthly maintenance. At the end of this video, you will be able to clean the spur blocks on the Vitus 3 instrument. Vitus spur blocks need to be cleaned monthly. The spur block cleaning procedure is initiated from the spur block cleaning area under System Menu Maintenance. It provides step by step instructions for cleaning all section spur blocks. Follow the on-screen prompts to perform the spur block cleaning. Turn the instrument power switch to off and then disconnect the power cord. Open the section flap door. Using a Dacron swab moistened with a detergent solution, carefully clean the interior of each spur liner. Flip the spur block towards you and hold it in this position so that you can easily access all the surfaces of the block. Clean all surfaces of the spur block with a decontamination wipe. When cleaning the rear surface of the spur block, press each spur liner to clean the bottom of the liners. Note: Make sure the cable is in the corresponding guide when releasing the spur block. Close the section doors. Repeat the complete procedure for each spur block. Reconnect the power cord. Turn on the instrument and wait for the initialization process to complete. The red LED light will be blinking because racks are always in error status after initialization. Remove and reinsert the racks to update their status.